Okay, so just to make you guys all aware, you have to have unlocked Radan for this one. Now, you don't actually have to have had him available, but you can just bypass the entire thing. You can practically just get straight into the castle. So the gate's going to be locked, and you're going to make your way around the right-hand side. Make sure you're careful of the gaps and the ads, but follow where I'm going, and then we can get into this video. At the end of it, though, you will notice that there is going to be somebody sat on a throne. He's going to be sat there waiting in front of a door. In your version of this, the door will be completely open, and you will be able to walk through there and go down a platform. That's going to take you to the teleporter that's going to enable you to go and defeat Radan. This is huge. This is wicked. But we're going to get into the armor set just after we've got to this location right here. <laughs> Okay guys, today we're taking a look at the Radan armor set. Now I'm hoping I'm saying his name right. If not, then screw that guy he's taken out anyway. This is going to be a really difficult armor set to get your hands on, mainly because you have to take out the demigod. You have obviously have to have already gone through Margaret and Godric, and now you are now on Radan. I can never get his bloody name. But once you have taken him out, you are going to be able to get hold of this. Now this is a difficult boss, because I have died in this. And then I died again. And even died a few more times after that. But this is probably one of the most enjoyable bosses to date. And it's got some relatively rotation technique and a really, really weird metric style. But this one is absolutely amazing. And I don't want to spoil it for you. So I'm only going to show you the first little bit of it. So you can gain the general premise of how it is. And maybe some a couple of the tricks. And you can notice that you can get the summons. And that you have to roll out of the way of specific darts and stuff like that. But other than that, this is going to be all about the armor. This is Radan. He's an absolute a-hole. But once you have got him done, we are going to take you through to probably the most important part of this. Not the boss fight. Not what you can get from the boss fight. It's what you get from the dude that's dead. Let's jump in. Okay, so we've taken out Radan and we have got the Remembrance of the Star Scourge. Now, this is the real important part. The reason this is the real important part is because this is what's going to get you your naughty armor set. And that's just how this works. Now, a lot of people do already know about this. A lot of people don't already know about this. But these things are actually used for numerous reasons. Now, you can actually get one from Godric as well. And you can utilize that to purchase one of two items. Now, the best thing about Radan is you can use that to purchase one of two items. But also we can get hold of the entire armor set on top of that now the way that these two items work just while we're on the quick topic of it is you can only use that remembrance for one item so make sure you pick it carefully because once you've picked that item you then have no chance of getting the second one you can on the other hand utilize the moving museums and stuff like that if you can take those down then you can use those to be able to duplicate your remembrances i'm pretty sure that's how that works anyway and you can get two and that's amazing now obviously once the the museum has gone then you can't utilize that one anymore and they only have one resource each but for me personally the remembrances aren't the important part i utilize the remembrance and then you can go ahead and head to the round table so we're going to head to the round table and we are going to go and purchase some of the most amazing armor sets that we've ever seen so once we get to the round table we are going to want to take a sharp right taking a sharp right is going to enable you guys to purchase this amazing amazing Amazing, amazing armor set but yeah that's pretty much it you go ahead to the right and make that purchase and once you have made that purchase you have then got the full armor set now obviously don't worry too much about runes you get around 80 to 85 thousand runes for taking out radan so splurge out a bit you deserve it go ahead and grab the whole bloody armor set and go ahead and grab a spear while you're at it but this is probably the best looking thing i've seen in the game so far and i absolutely love it if you guys like it as well, then make sure you go ahead and grab it. Let me know down in the comment section if you've got it already, or if you want any help with Radan, then feel free to hit me up on Twitter. The link will be down in the description. I just didn't want to ruin it too much for the video, just because, well, spoilers and all that. Thank you so much again for all of your outgoing support. We've just hit 25,000 subscribers, and we are on the route to that big old 30k. You guys are amazing. You guys are awesome. I appreciate your faces. And as always, I'll see you in the clouds.